but China has like amazing spy technology I think uh, here's the thing uh, like countries when they try to play the tech advantage that only works for a short period of time right and because technology is evolving Moore's law faster and faster and faster and faster and faster then the time span that a certain country has a technical technological advantage over someone else becomes shorter and shorter and shorter so tech advantage only goes so far now right it used to go a lot further in the past right look at United States when they developed nuclear weapons right that kept them the supreme power on earth right for two to three decades right but then russia started developing nuclear weapons faster and faster and faster and faster right the the from what we understand in korea the korean war the united states the west was losing the korean war and the only reason we have north and south korea right now is because united states said that they would play the new card right they turned to russia and china and north korea and said look if you guys don't cut a deal right now and we freeze the conflict we're going to use nukes and russia and china at the time didn't have nearly the nuclear power as the united states so they bowed down and said okay let's freeze the fucking conflict all right us can't do that anymore they can't come to russia in Ukraine and say hey listen we need to freeze the conflict right now or we're gonna use nukes Russia's gonna go what are you fucking crazy we got more nukes than you do right so that technological advantage is gone right gone right so that's the thing how long is that gonna last uh, and in my personal opinion uh, the two top countries in the world actually three top countries in the world with huge tech super supremacy right now right china is there but it's not the top three russia israel and the united states in my personal opinion i think united states israel and russia are technologically the superior uh the top three players in the game right now china coming up china coming up uh, they do have the supercomputers here but it's very focused it's limited uh, right now they'll catch up super fast in the next less than five years less than five years